In this video, I will show you how to take a photo from a video on your iPhone. This can be really useful if you see a moment in your video that you want to save as a picture. The process is simple and takes just a few steps. To get started, open up the Apple App Store on your iPhone. Once there, locate the search bar at the top of the screen and tap on it. Now, type in Toolbox and hit Search. Look for this exact app named Toolbox in the results. Once you've found it, tap on the Get button to download and install this app onto your device. After installing, go ahead and open up the Toolbox app. The first time you use it, you'll need to grant access to your photo library. You can choose to allow full access or limit it by selecting specific items that the app can access. This is entirely up to your preference. Once inside the app, scroll down until you find a section labeled Video. Within this section, look for an option called Extract Photo. Go ahead and tap on it. Next, you'll be prompted to choose a source for your video. You can select either your photo library or files app depending on where your video is stored. Select the video from which you want to save still images, and then tap Next. Now that you've selected your video, it will appear on screen along with a slider at the bottom. This slider allows you to navigate through different frames of your video. Drag this slider carefully until you reach exactly where you'd like to take a still image. Once you've pinpointed the desired frame, simply tap on the plus button located at the bottom left corner of your screen. This action will capture a still image of that specific frame. If you'd like more than one photo from different frames, just repeat these steps as needed. After capturing all desired images from your video, make sure to tap Finish. To save these images directly into your camera roll, tap on the Share button located at the bottom right corner of your screen. From here, simply tap Save Image, and voila! Your extracted photos are now saved directly into your camera roll. So that wraps up this tutorial. If you have any questions about this whole process, please let me know in the comments section below. And if this video helped you out, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more tutorial videos like this one. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day.